was love. <laughs> they do not want me reading out loud. Good morning. Oh, good. And the next one. We good. Right, right. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night to you. I pray you good. If not, time to read the good news one more time. Amen. My grandma time. I'm a little uh, excited, but I'm trying to stay calm, okay? I, I, I ain't been asleep, man. Past three and a half days. I had like, I had like three or four days. I probably been asleep maybe an hour or to get. <laughs> Uh, when I say, for those who sleeping on Jesus Christ, when you ask for Jesus, he is not something you want to blink and miss, okay? You, it, and I ain't talking about trying to see him by his sight. I'm talking about when he show up. You don't want to get rid of him. And you know he wants to keep you hoping you keep him. You understand? Once you make him Lord and Savior of your life, you talking about the greatest gift for your life before you lose your life. He calling on Jesus Christ. Okay. People really don't believe I've been doing the same thing my whole life. Man. Just wasn't able to put everything in front of the camera. I would have loved to. It would have been like another version of the uh, Jim Carrey movie. Uh, the True Man Chef. The True Man Chef. The very first time I saw that movie, I was like, yep, that's exactly what it feel like out here. Been inspired on every way you can. And, and people people walking up to you or they around you and they like, uh, right, right. I'm like, that must be the Holy Spirit sparking something, bitch. I just show up, man. That's too bright. That's too bright. I'm like, well, I'd rather be bright with the Lord Jesus than dark and, 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 and slowly, slowly, or quickly leaving this life. You feel me? I'd rather be with Jesus Christ. I, I, I've i come to realization it's going to take y'all the last minute to get it. Yeah. And then it's too late. Yeah. I just don't want y'all to blame me for you not accepting why you didn't want to make Jesus Christ your Lord and Savior. You have to show the lake of fire Instead of the one who created heaven for you and him. I can't lose an already won fight. Okay. I'm just trying to include you. Reading all that. Gonna bless you just for doing it. We all know it is. Y'all know it is. Um. <laughs> I, I've never witnessed 
same pride in people then. Since I moved down here, people so fill up themselves. No humility, bruh. Nah. Nah. Not one ounce of consideration. I'm not talking about everybody. I'm talking about those who been messaging me since I've been down here. It's all about them getting what they want and keeping it moving. It's not a win-win situation. It's it's a take take situation. It's not a give give situation. It's a take take situation. I don't want that. I don't want those or that happening around me, near me. Just me uh reading these messages has woke me up to realize the trap y'all have set to me. <laughs> when I say y'all set me up with this trap, that's why God had me make the profiles on it. I was like, you is not playing just. Yeah, I need you to see what's around me without seeing what's around me. Yeah, this is what I get for asking for one women, okay? Women, I'm not greedy, okay? One of y'all is enough, man. Just because these men don't know what they're doing with y'all, don't blame me for what I already mastered and know about you women. Y'all not hard to please. Y'all not, man. Because y'all can't handle the truth, man. Y'all run from me and go play with anything but the truth. Because you can't handle the truth. You want to control it when it's supposed to bless you. Slow and steady. You want to harden fast and miss everything. So man, do your thing. I'm saying we can go slow and steady and build the temple at hard and fast. Just ain't no... You don't hit the G spot. In the rest, no. Y'all out here sizing each other up just to feel good, only to understand you missed out on a lot. So you get married. To do those love making things. Y'all call it you no know, yeah, yeah. I don't want to say the F word. I'm trying not to catch but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. having this conversation first cause <laughs> Y'all are funny, but this don't make no sense, man. And y'all okay with it. You know, that's the, that's the wild part. Y'all okay with being married and cheating on each other. Uh, and you want me to join in. I'm not a cheater. Uh, uh, I'm not. You know, I, I get no arousal out of covenant. Out of co- I get no excitement out of being the savage. I don't. I don't. That's how you know a real man different from a demon, okay? <laughs> Those who chase lust are demons, man. They can't help themselves. But the first part of knowing Jesus Christ is him teaching you self-control in your lust, okay? And, and I'm mad y'all don't go to Jesus. Because you know how to tell you how to get through that. The first thing y'all do is is 
belittle the one who understands his own creation. Instead of defiling each other, because that's all y'all doing. If you're not doing it with Jesus, you don't defile and expect peace, man. It, it, I'm, I'm, uh, for y'all not to believe that your own creator don't know your sexual frustration. <laughs> I've made it clear to me I don't need to be rushing where I'm going with this. I don't. I, the only thing I'm learning is that every man that lied to all you women out here going against me. And that and that is the whole point of this whole thing. How do you hate me and I'm not around you for you to hate? <laughs> and I can remember women pulling me to the side. Believe it or not, you, you, the exception. Hit me with the uh, the white one we know to do. Thank you, yeah, cause I don't want the one. You feel me? The white one was in Russia, but I couldn't get over there, cause I had a bunch of fake friends and family trying to stop me from getting over there. Let's read the book of Romans. Romans. Good. One more time, one more time. Chapter 15. I'm going to keep saying that. Cause I will never forget how fresh they were to keep me from not being joyful and not having anything God has prepared for me to have. Them doing everything they got to about to make sure I don't get it. But you call yourself a Christian? Hey, how you call yourself a Christian? You 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 stopping me blessing you by you trying to stop me. How, make that make sense, fam. Like, <laughs> like, make that make sense. If you stop me from getting my blessing, you're not going to get blessed. Everything you thought was a blessing when you stopped me from, when you when you hindered me, delayed me, all God said was He going a hundredfold that. Crap, man, must apply that hundredfold. I'm like, look, I'm not, I'm not like everybody else. I'm good with one thing, man. They can't, they can't do with just one thing. They need attention. I appreciate attention, the right attention. I'm not pressed for it, no. I, I'm, man, God is real, y'all. If you sit there and call in Jesus, you will realize you was never alone when you was horny and all that. He was right there. You all you had to do was call him, man. And y'all be doing the most, still sending me naked pictures after. Look, y'all need to stop saying I believe in keeping it discreet. There's no privacy on the internet, y'all. That's why I, when I get up on her, I be like, let's give him a show, man. They already spying on it. There is no privacy on the internet. None. I don't care how many hacking, uh, hacking, encrypting codes you gotta break. If God can see, He can send somebody else to top it up and see too. There's no privacy on the internet, sweetheart. So if you think you're gonna try to set me up for the fraud, you messing up. Man, I'm like, please don't do that, okay? I don't want to see you hurt. I want to see you blessed. 
Okay. It's, I really want to see you blast because burning in the lake of fire is not an option for me. No, it's not. So, chapter 15 on page 1,564. And the book I was blessed with by my mother and grandma. Sorry to say, but a couple of people who tried to take me out. <laughs> All right, so we're going to pray. When your own mother wants you dead, after your father that you never met just ended up dead. <laughs> and, and you have no interest in Being impressed to be in anybody's surrounding, but you know that they trying to do everything to be in your, but not for the right reason. Like, not about to drain my energy. Yeah. Yeah. Not about to drain my life. So I'm going to read and give you life with the permission God blessed me with. To read out loud. Amen. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you, Father. Holy God, Almighty, Wonderful Counselor, Sovereign Creator, Amazing Love Maker. Thank you, Lord. For this opportunity, just to say thank you. For this gift of today, to be woken up by you. One more time. <laughs> One more time. One more time. Yeah. Thank you. That in the midst of our world wars, the world wars and fights, Debate, division, and confusion, chaos. You keep instilling wisdom and knowledge in me not to trip on thinking about the worldly things. You have me focused on the things above where you are. And thank you for keeping my brain focused on the point where you are. Right. That way, all others will be made to obey your word and will. Amen. Father God, I come to you not for me, but for those who are lost and need to be found. Before you arrive, take them out. I don't need that blood on my hands. Lord, I thank you. For hearing me pray this prayer for those who need to be saved. And I pray through that saving that they worship and praise you non-stop in a cheerful, loving, joyful way. To the point we know it's not fake because it's contagious. It rubs off to others freely, fearlessly. Getting rid of all evil and wickedness. Trying to drown them. Your marvelous light wipes it out so they can swim upstream again. To our Lord and Savior who has his hands out ready to uplift us again. No matter what we're going through, we can call on him until we can't. And I pray that before that, well, that those who need to be saved, however, they need to be convicted. Thank you for doing that. Man. That way I know this work is not in vain and you are getting the glory out of everything. In Jesus' name. Amen. Thank God.
Hey, Randy, damn. Oh. Good. And then that's one. Yeah, it is. So. <laughs> I'm going to always have hope because you do not want to be burning up in the lake of fire, fam. That, is, that should not be an option for no, none of God's creation. Did y'all not hear what he did with the flood? Come on, y'all. Please, fam. Please. Chapter 15, verse 1. <laughs> Oh, hold on, man. Got me crying, like, because y'all can't be that stupid. You can't be. I refuse to believe that y'all that stupid, man. But his word does say, you don't believe in Jesus Christ, you are Buddhist. That means stupid. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Verse 1, chapter 15. Book of Romans, in case you forgot, all right? Cook it. Here you go. We then that are strong ought to bear the infirmities of the weak, Sorry. and not to please ourselves. Hey. <laughs> Verse 2. Let every one of us please his neighbor for his good to edification. Period. Verse 3. For even Christ pleased not himself. Semicolon. But, comma, as it is written, comma, the reproaches of them that reproach thee fell on me. Period. Right, we got a title at verse 4. Let's say, uh, Unity in Christ. Verse 4. For whatsoever things were written aforetime, were written for our learning, that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. P. Verse 5. Now the God of patience and consolation grants you to be like-minded, one toward another, according to Christ Jesus. Colon. Verse 6, that ye may with one mind and one mouth glorify God, Colon. even the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. Period. Verse 7, wherefore receive ye one another, Colon. As Christ also received us to, to the glory of God. Period. Verse 8. Now I say that Jesus Christ was a minister of the circumcision for the truth of God. To confirm the promises made unto the Father's calling. Verse 9. And that the Gentiles might glorify God for his mercy. Semicolon. As it is written, come, for this cause I will confess to thee among the Gentiles, come, and sing unto thy name. Pray. Verse 10. And again, he saith, come, rejoice, come, ye Gentiles, come, with his people. Pray. Verse 11. And again, come, thy forspitting. And again, comma, praise the Lord, comma, all ye Gentiles, semicolon, and laud him, comma, all ye people, period. Verse 12. And again, comma, Isaiah, or Isaiah, saith, there shall be a root of justice, comma, and he that shall rise to reign over the Gentiles, semicolon, and him shall the Gentiles trust. And my nose running through my eyes. You cannot leave me alone, bro. Oh. Let me repeat that. Verse 12. And again, comma, 
Isaiah, or Isaiah, say it, comma. There shall be a root of Jesse, comma, and he that shall rise to reign over the Gentiles, semicolon, and him shall the Gentiles trust, period. Verse 13. Now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace and belief, comma, that ye may abound in hope, comma, through the power of the Holy Ghost, period. We got another type. The success of Paul labors. The success. Success. I don't know if it's something like that. The success of Paul labors. Verse, verse uh, 14. And I myself also am persuaded of you, comma, my brethren, comma, that ye also are full of goodness, comma, filled with all knowledge, comma, able also to admonish one another, period. Verse 15. Nevertheless, comma, brother, comma, I have written the more boldly unto you in some sort, comma, as putting you in mind, comma, because of the grace that is given to me of God, comma, Verse 16, that I should be the minister of Jesus Christ to the Gentiles, comma, ministering the gospel of God, comma, that the offering of, of the Gentiles might be acceptable, comma, being sanctified by the Holy Ghost. Period. Verse 17, I have therefore whereof I may glory through Jesus Christ in those things which pertain to God. Please. Verse 18. For I will not dare to speak of any of those things which Christ hath not wrought by me, to make the Gentiles obedient, by word and deed. Verse 19. Through mighty signs and wonders, by the power of the Spirit of God, semicolon, so that from Jerusalem, comma, and round about unto Illyricum, pray I said that right, Illyricum, comma, I have fully preached the gospel of Christ, period, verse 20, yea, comma, so have I strived to preach the gospel, comma, not where Christ was named, lest I should build upon another man's foundation. Come. Verse 21. But as it is written, come, to whom he was not spoken of, come, they shall see, come, and they that have not heard shall understand. Pray. Verse 22. For which cause also I have been much hindered from coming to you. Pray. Verse 23. But now having no more place in these parts, comma, and having a great desire these many years to come into you, semicolon, verse 24, whensoever I take my journey into Spain, comma, I will come to you, comma, for I will trust to see you in my journey, comma, and to be brought on my way thitherward by you, comma. If first I be somewhat filled with your company, period, verse 25, but now I go unto Jerusalem to minister unto the saints, period, verse 26, for it hath pleased them of Macedonia and Achaia, I pray I said that right, Achaia, to make a certain contribution for the poor saints which are at Jerusalem, period. Verse 27, it hath pleased them verily, semicolon, and their debtors they are, period. For if the Gentiles have been made partakers of their spiritual thing, comma, their duty is also to minister unto them in carnal things, period. Verse 28, when therefore I have performed it, comma, 
and have sold to them this fruit. I will come by you into Spain. Period. Verse 29. And I am sure that, comrade, when I come unto you, comrade, I shall come in the fullness of the blessing of the gospel of Christ. Period. Verse 30. <clears throat> now I beseech you, comrade, brethren, comrade, for the Lord Jesus Christ's sake, comrade, and for the love of the Spirit, comrade, that ye strive together with me in your prayers to God for me. Semicolon. Verse 31. That I may be delivered from them that do not believe in Judea. Semicolon. And that my service, which I have for Jerusalem, may be accepted of the saints. Semicolon. Verse 32. That I may come unto you with joy. By the will of God, come, and may with you be refreshed. Period. Verse 33. Now the God of peace be with you all. Period. Amen. Oh, that's the end. No, it's not. Oh. Wow. In the Romans chapter 15. Wow. So the unity in Christ, the success of Paul's labor. If you are not healed or fulfilled, please go back and reread that after you pray for the Holy Spirit. <coughs> the God's good. <coughs> Supposed to be outside, but I forgot to uh, put my uh, the rest of my clothes. In the dry. Y'all know only got like two pairs of pants, right? <laughs> yeah, because y'all not about to Americanize me. Yeah, I keep trying that. Uh, another word for American to me is forced consumerism. Force. Like, y'all go to other people's country, you try to force your consumerism down their throat. Like, now every country want to want to go to war with not only Israel but USA too. Whatever y'all talk, I say to these men who keep believing in these worldly titles. <laughs> God about to take your title and shove it up where it don't shine, okay? And that's going to be the end of you because you keep not repenting like I tell you to. Y'all keep thinking y'all going to come to God and destroy God's children and his future for, the, for, for, for his children. That is not going to happen, man. If you end up in hell, we're going to fight, man. I'm kicking you behind, man. I'm not playing, man. I'm not, man. Ladies, please pray for your your brothers out here. Dude. And pray for your sisters out here, brothers. Y'all supposed to be helping each other reach the goal of being help and care one to another according to God's instruction. When you call on Jesus Christ. Well, that's a lot in there. So Paul was basically professing, humble yourself and care for one in it. That's the basic. Do not sleep on the Holy Ghost and humble yourself. God loved you. Wow. And, and, and I pray God separate the pride from, from those who are actually pursuing Jesus with all their heart, man, body, soul, and spirit. So that those that's proud won't have no place 
lead those who are innocent in God's eyes. Okay. I, that's what that's my prayer, cause it is not gonna be. It's, 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 what I'm getting, y'all who don't believe, y'all gonna wish you believe, okay? In Jesus' name, man. Y'all do know Jesus was betrayed by his own people, okay? Right? So what makes you think if you are a follower of Jesus, you're not going to be betrayed it? I'm here to remind you, God builds you up to work with him. Okay? He's not just going to have you working with him when you're not equipped. <laughs> no. Like being a follower of Jesus is like being a, a, a ninja, but a harmless one. But not against those who who trying to harm God's people. It defends it God's people from being harmed, and it takes care of its enemies. When you don't believe, please go back and read. Okay. For those who hate on another, you need to check your heart. Because you're going to start with God entering your heart when you call him Jesus. So that the Holy Spirit can, can break you down and make you back in. I need y'all to do the inside work and read. Yeah. When you read, it breaks all that down. And when you start to get joy while you read it, 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 it builds you up after being broken down. And then you just keep going. There's no, there's no rush. Your personal relationship with Jesus it's the only thing you need to focus on. Because he's going to tell you how to treat others. Biblically. Okay. <laughs> I had to say that because when you are following Jesus and you actually obey his instruction, it's biblical how you move out here. Disguised as a righteous soldier in a cruel, crooked, evil, dark world. That's why he said you are the light of the world. Like Jesus is the light of the world. You are the light of the world. When you do your part. And I pray that none of this goes in vain and that someone will be healed and blessed. Fulfilled, satisfied to the mind, body, soul, and spirit, nothing less. And y'all enjoy your day. Happy Monday. Don't be stressing yourself out. Somebody trying to tick you off, walk away. Sing a loud song or, or hum, hum a tune while you walking away. Don't let them get you. Not to rejoice in Jesus on this day, okay? Rejoice. Y'all keep forgetting to do that. I know y'all don't rejoice. That's why I had to do that part too. After I read, I had to rejoice with y'all because I know y'all <laughs> don't know what to do with y'all stuff out here. But it's like y'all looking pathetic, man. Yeah, you got all this material crap. 
Now, how that feel, man? And you empty on the inside. Fulfill that special food. Fulfill it by filling your yourself up. Providing peace and growth of wisdom and knowledge in your spirit that you've been keeping dead. <laughs> Uh, Y'all had me out here laughing yesterday, early day. I ain't got no sleep in the past three or four days. Probably like 30, 30 minutes to an hour. Y'all know I live here. I don't want to hear nothing less. <laughs> I better not hear nothing less, Trev. All right, so I'm trying to save some time for the uh, making more... Uh, videos before I get cut off without knowing because hopefully this is the last week with this phone. I'm supposed to get the new phone as soon. That's what I was told. So it might be a minute when I upload. If it's not today, it, it might be a minute. That might mean I got the new phone and got to, you know, set it up and you know, all that. And then boom. Just pray for one another. Pray for me as I pray for you. To have a blessed, lovely day. And if you in your last, call Jesus to get you through it. Okay? At least call on Jesus. Okay? Give it, try it. Yeah. Or oh, I can't help myself. Um, you think he don't know? He created sexual creatures for a reason. Yeah. And the stupidest thing y'all do is don't call on the one who knows who is the master. Of it. Hey, that makes no sense, y'all. Y'all out here killing each other off because you keep denying the master to teach you what to do. Yeah. You want to stay young forever? Learn to be a lovemaker. It's that simple, man. Y'all know I'm not lying, man. A couple of people, like, what is it, like, Last month or something was like, the one you look young, younger, man, everybody looking old. I'm like, bro, well, you don't see all this? He's like, nah, but you still look like young. I'm like, man. When you are a love maker, God will make it clear. Okay? I, I think I look old, okay? Right now, even though, hey, but. They kept saying you look young. Right now, I, I, what I'm saying with all this, and yeah, you look old. Like an old man, okay? <laughs> Only 39, okay? So, you want to stay young forever? Yeah, I'm talking to these old people now, okay? They've they been talking about <laughs> things backwards. They, been, they, they haven't been given good examples, but they did what they could. Okay? Got to give them that. They did what they could. Well, when it comes to you on my watch, pay attention, please. Please. Yeah. To how you read and what you read and how you express it out loud when you read in front of your heavenly father. Don't worry about nobody else. He will bring them to you or send them or send you where you need to go to fulfill his kingdom. Nothing less. <clears throat> so he's messing with my throat and not you. So I'm going to get up out of here. Catch y'all later. Stop killing each other off. Talking to you speed demons. And to those who rock with me, stay strong. Edify. Don't be scared. Build your build your strength by believing that the Holy Spirit, which is the Holy Ghost, is dwelling in you, reminding you to go take care of that when you need to. I'm talking about your mission for the Lord Jesus Christ. Right? Don't give up. He ain't give up on you.
I'm one of your ear off. I just want y'all to know I love y'all, man. Yeah. I will not be chasing nobody, bro. Peace. And then nothing, man. Right. Good.